Okay, I'm going to melt a little bit of my computer gold tonight. So we got about, I think, 15 grams in there that I just dumped some out. That ain't good. So we're going to pick this up. And what I dropped on the floor, we'll get it in the furnace and see if I got 15 grams and we're done. I'm going to melt it in this little guy right here and uh, probably pour it in there, do a little button. Because I have these molds here, but they're not very big. The biggest one I got, I think, is a 5 gram, and I got more than that. So, we'll see what it looks like when we're done. Thanks, bye. Okay, so we're up and rolling. Only been going for about two minutes, so I don't expect anything to be really melting yet. Don't want to melt my phone. But we'll see. I'll see what it looks like. Lights out. That's kind of cool. But we'll come back when she's melted. Alright, we're going to try to do this one handed. <clears throat> Pretty sure, oh, you're not going to be able to see. <laughs> I did heat up the crucible that I'm going to pour it into a little bit. Trying to get a well that didn't really did go good. <laughs> well I did add something different this time. Normally I just melt it by itself, but when they sent me this kit, they sent me it's called flux. I added that this time, so maybe that's what's all around it. And my gold button is right in the middle of all that flux so when I pop it out of there I will let you know okay yeah I won't be doing it like that again it was really hard to get out of there I had to heat it up with a torch and but there's my gold button and this is from computer e scrap and I have refined it once um, so I know it's at least 22 carat I tested for that I probably will refine it again, but I was bored tonight and wanted to melt it, and so I did. And there you go. Alright, thanks for watching.